Okay, so for this, you're going to need your hair. Obviously, your hair can be wet, dry, just gotten out of, like, the pool or anything. This is also really easy to do in front, not in front of a mirror. So, you know, yeah. This is my natural hair. It has nothing in it. I put it up in a top knot this morning when it was still wet. Um, and it's still pretty wet right now. So, yeah. Um, so this is what my hair looks like. You'll need a brush. Mine has a mirror on the back, but whatever. A brush. This is the one I keep at my desk. Um, for when I do hair tutorials, I don't use this one normally. You, fun fact, I don't use this brush very often. Um, I don't know. Of course. I'll get it for right there. Okay. You'll need, dry <laughs> grab it, two hair ties. Um, any, you know, hair ties. And if your hair is dry, you can definitely do this with a elastic. You'll need then just one hair tie and elastic. But if your hair is wet, definitely use two normal hair ties. Um, because they're gentler in your hair than elastic and they're not going to break it. And then a headband if you want. You do not need this. This is optional. And you'll also need a clip. Just any size clip. My brother has two friends over it and they're in the living room like screaming. Okay, so the first thing, I didn't close my door either, so sorry about that. So the first thing I'm going to do is brush my hair. I forgot I had to brush, brush my hair. I know you can yell me all I want because my hair is wet and I'm using a brush, but whatever. Um, it's what I have sitting right here. Uh, this morning when I did it, though, I did brush with a comb. I typically do. I don't like brushing my hair with a brush, but that's what I have right here. So, yeah. I really wish my hair would dry straight. I can't it dry straight. Curly hair girl problems. The bottom is really wet. The bottom is dry, though, because it's stuck out of the ponytail. Like, all this is will be braided, so the bottom is dry, but the middle is funny. <laughs> okay. So, I don't part my hair when I do top knots. Um, so... Alright, I'm going to take one hair tie, and I always like to use the one that is more stretched out for the top and the one that's tighter for the bottom. So I'm just going to go ahead and pull all my hair up. Oh, and if you're sitting down, a good way to do this is to look back and, oh, I'm not feeling able to see, but I'll try to show you. You're going to comb all your hair back and grab it. Pull it up, and it reduces all your bumps on top. Okay. Then I'm going to go ahead and secure this. Flip my chair. Okay, then I kind of like my top knot off to the side a little bit, so I'm going to pull my hair up, pull, I can tell out just a little bit, maybe, and kind of turn, pull to the side, and then tighten it, and it's going to very slightly move it over, okay. Then I'm going to pull my hair to one side and section it into three pieces. So one piece, two piece, three piece. And if you know how to basic braid, you can do this basically um, not in front of a mirror. I don't know if I said that or not. Um, but it's really easy to not do it in front of a mirror. As long as you can like basic braid and make a ponytail. And even if there's like a couple bumps, it's not that bad because it's supposed to be messy. It's not, you know, it's supposed to be prim and proper. If you did like slick your hair back, you could wear this prim and properly, I guess. If you wanted to, and then take a hair tie or your elastic. <sighs> tie it at the bottom. And pull the thing ever so slightly. Alright, now my hair's on the left, so I'm going to go to the right. If your hair's on the right, go to the left. Then I'm going to put my hand here on top, like this, and start wrapping. And that reduces this funny bulk 
bulky piece that will come through. And then it's gonna look like that. And once you get it the way you like it, take your hair clip and clip it in the back. Like that. Then to finish it off, I always think it looks better if I had a hair tie. Or a headband. These are by Scunty and they're the ones with like the um like the rubber on the inside. I really like it. I really like this one. Just the black one. And there you go. It's really simple, easy, and you can wear it. When school goes back in, you can, you know, wear it after the pool, whatever, all that kind of fun stuff. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.